within a bag, within a bag, and then a bag in that bag, and then a bag in that bag in that bag. what you do and what you don't need to take when you go on your next con adventure. I'm going to be going to the Emerald City Comic Con next month and I'm super excited and I'm starting to pack my bag now with all of the things I'm going to take so hopefully this will help you guys and especially you noobs out on what essentials you're going to need. Now I'm kind of a crazy bag lady Okay, so I'm a crazy bag lady. But everything that I'm going to be taking, you guys don't have to take with you. This is just kind of my crap that I need to have with me to keep my mind at peace. So, hmm. Let's start off with the bag that I will be taking. Um, I'm going to be taking this super cute beige backpack. I highly suggest taking a backpack. Um, usually a purse can really get in the way and it's kind of hard to like manage and you want your hands to like be free and open to touch all of the fabulous things that you need to touch at a convention. Like butts. So here on my backpack I have definitely displayed my uh, jazzy backpack flair. Um, this is kind of fun to do. It just kind of shows people what you're into. Um, I have a Care Bears button. I got BMO, and I gotta gotta represent the Thundercats. Uh, Zelda, and then I have this cute little button that says Lilu Dallas Multipass. It's 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 awesome. Before you leave the house or your hotel room, make sure you put your badge in your bag. You're going to need this to get into the convention center. If you don't have this, they're not going to let you in. And your friends are just going to go in without you. And make sure you have a really good lanyard that will hold your badge so your badge doesn't fall off or get pulled off. And you can also put flare on your lanyard. Another thing that I like to keep in my bag is the program. This will be your one-eyed willy treasure map to all of the shiny, beautiful things inside of the convention center. Minus the Fratellis. What else do I got in this bag of tricks? I like to pack a water bottle. Water can be stupid expensive at conventions, and I'd rather spend $5 on maybe a original He-Man action figure that I've been looking for, and not a bottle of water. I'm a total wiener, and I get cold all the time, so I usually like to pack a sweater or something with some long sleeves in case I get a chill. I ain't afraid of no ghosts. Now I love me a good pouch. Um, I use these to keep me organized with all of my little trinkets and treasures because I must be organized. So inside this beautiful little pouch, which is handcrafted by me, um, I like to have notebook and pen. I got, oh my god, the bagception begins. I have this little pouch inside this pouch. Um, in here I have hair bobs and hair ties in case I may need them. Um, oh, and a tampon. Yeah, we all love those. Um, I have some ibuprofen in case somebody gets a headache. Um, I do not like to contribute to the funky smells that are lingering around the cons. So I make sure to have a little... A little perfume and a little deodorant because I am not going to contribute to that gross ass smell. Um, what else do I have in here? Oh, hand sanitizer. 
Um, and some lotion, in case I need some lotion. This is my Coco Chanel Mademoiselle. Uh, this is what Baby Jesus smells like. And girls, if you're going to be wearing your Jeffrey Campbells, take some Band-Aids. Put everything back in the pouch. Oh, look, it's another pouch. This is going to be my makeup bag. Now, when you're wearing makeup up to like 8 to 12 hours, it tends to melt off or shift on your face. And melting face gross makeup is not a cute look. Not cute. Um, in here, I like to keep my makeup basics, um, things to keep my face from moving around. Um, I have things like powder compact. I got a Sailor Moon compact mirror. This thing is amazing and it's so cute and I get so many compliments on it. Um, I can totally fight crime with this thing. No joke. That's how cute it is. <laughs> I got a... Uh, some lip gloss, depending on whatever lipstick or lip gloss I'm wearing that day. Throw it in the bag. Uh, let's see. Got a Burt's Bees chapstick. The best chapstick in the world. And, ooh, this is one of my favorites. This is Lush's Lip Balm, The Kiss. And it's amazing. And it smells so good. And it feels awesome on your lip skins. So good. And what else do we got in here? Oh, and um, I might be wearing some wood elf ears, so in case I need some patchwork, I got a little spirit gum in here. And that's everything in there. So at any convention, you're going to have so many opportunities to stand in line for a very, very long time. Whether you're waiting to get into Hall H, or you're waiting for Patrick Stewart's autograph, or you're standing in line for three hours to play the Alien Isolation demo at the PAX. So you can get one of these amazing patches. It was totally worth it. Totally worth it. So worth it. So if you get stuck in a situation like that, you might want to take some snacks. These are going to keep your energy up and keep you from getting cranky. Because if I don't eat, I become a crazy, angry person. So I like to pack some, let's see, I got some Star Wars fruit snacks and some granola bars. And you can take some trail mix. Whatever you want to snack on. I made this. This is my powder toast man tote. Um, I love to take this and just fold it up and stick it in my backpack. Not all of the vendors are going to have shopping bags. So if you have smaller merchandise, freebies, it's definitely nice to have an extra bag to put that stuff in. Or you can let your friend borrow it that's with you who is not prepared. I am a good friend. Another thing you're going to need is a wallet. I pack a really small one so I have more room in my bag for other crap. Uh, I just take my driver's license, my debit card, and I'm a total weirdo, and I have to have my medical insurance card with me for some crazy reason. I don't know. It's a thing. And make sure you got something with like a little zipper on it that you can stick your cash money flow in. I have no money. Ugh. I'm part of the Cool Kids with Glasses Club. So I make sure to take my glasses case to put my glasses in and I can keep my sunglasses in here also. I wear my sunglasses at night. I don't know all the words to this song. I don't always wear clothing that has pockets and not saying I go naked. Um, I put fashion before function. So I like to take this little fanny pack pouch thing that I made. Um, I like to keep my phone in here so I have like super fast access to it in case I need to like snap a picture of somebody or call someone. I don't know. Just It's just nice to have it right there. Right there. And be like, bam! Talking to people. Fanny pack. Another item you're really going to want is your cell phone. And if you're contemplating taking your cell phone, then that's really weird because you're going to need it. Uh, pictures, video, 
you get lost, call your friends, find out where they deserted you. Um, mine's in a really cute Game Boy case. Another item that I like to take that doesn't fit in my backpack is I like to take a portfolio. I spend a lot of money on prints and comic books and not all of the artists or comic book seller people are going to have bags and boards. So I have this amazing thing that I can just kind of slip all of my stuff in so it doesn't, oh god, so, <laughs> just make sure it doesn't fall out. So it stays safe. Um, it is kind of annoying to carry around, um, but offer your group of friends you're with that, hey, if you guys want to stick some of your stuff in here, you are more than welcome to it, but you're going to have to be part of the Carrying Portfolio Club. Okay, everybody, so that's everything. That's all the stuff I'm planning on taking with me to the Emerald City Comic Con next month. I hope this video helped you guys out on deciding what to take, what not to take, or maybe I gave you some ideas on some things for when you go on your next con adventure. And like I said, you don't have to pack all these things. This is just all the crap that I like to tote around. I'm a little bit of a pack rat. If you haven't subscribed, please do. Thank you so much for watching this video. And what are you guys taking on your next con adventure? Let me know. Comment down in the comment region of what's going on down there. And all of my links and everything will be in the description box.